that I want to quickly cut across to Geeta Mohan. Uh, guests remain with us on this special broadcast as we wait for Prime Minister Narendra Modi's arrival at the hotel. And Geeta, uh, now that the people know that the Prime Minister has landed, is now en route, uh, are, are crowds increasing? Is there a surge? There is. There are certainly more people than before. Uh, but like I said, uh, unlike last time or the previous time, uh, Gaurav, where most of the action used to be right outside his hotel, this time around the entire area behind, if you see it right in front of his hotel, has been cordoned off. And there's only this area where the Indian community, uh, the Indian Americans, can stand. Uh, there are uh, quite a few people from the Indian diaspora who will be meeting Prime Minister inside the hotel. Uh, but yet we see a lot of excitement. Uh, the flags are up and uh, they're waiting uh, over here to see, get a glimpse of Prime Minister Modi. You think he's going to come down and meet and greet you? Okay, he's already landed, so he will in some time be coming and uh, reaching uh, uh, the, the, the hotel. Uh, what we are also given to understand, uh, Gaurav, is that his car stops there and he'll walk up to the Indian uh, uh, Americans waiting outside his hotel. So that's what they believe, that's what they think is going to happen. He'll have to wait and see. Uh, on a number of occasions, Prime Minister Narendra Modi has done in the past, has done that in the past, but there have been some occasions where he did not really come out and uh, meet them. But this is a very important year. It's the last year of his second term. Uh, and this is important for Biden as well. Uh, last year of his term as well. Both are looking at important outcome, but both are also Modi is looking at this community, the Indian American, to, to boost uh, the ties between the two. Sure that there is forward movement in other. That leg we will be covering when Prime Minister Narendra Modi reaches DC. Over here, it's going to be a lot of optics, a lot of visuals with the Indian community, and a lot uh, of visuals from the UN headquarters. Uh, the UN United Nations Secretary General Gaurav has already tweeted. There are important leaders from the US who have already uh, welcomed Prime Minister Modi. So, in some time from now, to some of these people, uh, Prime tell Minister us, Modi uh, will be reaching you know, what are their expectations the of the Prime Minister's of visit? See if you can talk to us, some, some of these people, the men, the women, the children who are there, Geeta. Okay, uh, let's just go across to so them. There are a lot of people with a lot of color over here, and let's just go across to them. Uh, one, of, one of the most interesting things, Gaurav, that I've seen uh, is um, uh, people who are wearing um, Nehru jackets with Modi's picture imprinted. Uh, elderly gentlemen over here uh, who have, look at that. Why this jacket, sir? Mr. Patel, tell us. Why this jacket? Why this jacket, sir? Why are you wearing this jacket? Why are you wearing this jacket? Because I respect and I like Mr. Modi. He's my prime minister. And he's the number one prime minister in India. After Sardar Vallobhai Patel. Where did you get the jacket? Was it made here or in India? No, I made in India. Okay. And my car is a number three. My okay, car. again, very interesting, Gaurav. Look at this. Uh, his cars Mr. keep changing. Yeah, Mr. Patel's uh, cars keep changing, but the uh, number plate does not. Uh, we have people over here. Do you know who the Indian Prime Minister is? What? The Indian Prime Minister. Do you know what's happening over yeah, here? Yeah, we know that he's coming, and that's why we're waiting. Oh, you're also waiting. Yeah. So, uh, uh, Gaurav, not just the Indian American community. American people want to see Modi. Okay. We got a jacket. We like it, Modi. Okay. Number one is Modi. Uh, this. Modi has the Mumkin Gaurav, uh, not just uh, the Indian American community. We have a lot of youngsters, a lot of women over here waiting uh, because they've seen a lot of people over here so, from Israel. Okay, they're also, they're also traveling from Israel. India and Israel have great ties, and uh, we have these Israeli women who are waiting over here. Uh, to see and get a glimpse of Prime Minister Modi. So it's not just the Indian Americans uh, who uh, are over here because they have been Modi supporters, like we have been discussing earlier, Gaurav. Uh, in D.C., you will see maybe a battle between the supporters and the protesters that has happened in the past as well. Uh, but the flags are up, uh, American and Indian flags, and quite a bit of excitement over here. 
um, again, like I have been saying, the crowd outside the hotel is not as large as it used to be, uh, but also because it's been distributed. There are some outside, uh, there are some inside the hotel, uh, and uh, they are very confident that Prime Minister Modi is going to stop. So this is the entire stretch outside the hotel that used to be completely filled with people, but yes. this time around, they've cordoned off the area and, and confined the Indians uh, to one uh, smaller space. Uh, in, in all probability, it has to do with security, uh, but Prime Minister Modi in the past has done it and could do it again, which is when he arrives, uh, he might step out of his car uh, and walk up from that door over there to Gita, as the Indian, as the Indian American community here. is concerned, uh, are they also very concerned about the visa backlog? Uh, is, that, is that something that could also be taken up at the level of the Prime Minister and the President? Because more visas mean more interaction between the people in India and people in the United States of America. The backlog has actually impacted this. Well, that's right. You are absolutely right. The backlog is something that has been raised at various levels uh, by the Indian side, uh, including External Affairs Minister Dr. Jay Shankar when he met with his counterpart, Secretary Blinken. But uh, at the highest level, expect uh, two very important aspects when it comes to travel, people to people, uh, connect and engagement, which is visas and the immigration policy. Not just with regards to delaying visas, but also with regards to how many visas can be issued uh, to people seeking employment from India into the United States of America. That also has become very difficult. So uh, looking at the immigration policy as well.